Oh. You should be able to see me now. And this is not going to fall off this time, I promise. Okay. I promise. Because I got an issue with the app that deals with my Facebook page. I don't know what's wrong with that, but... Okay. Okay. We're still working. Still working to connect. As soon as I see you, I will invite you. Okay. There you are. Estamos haciendo que está con la 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 con Hi! Oh, I'm so happy to have you here. So just let me introduce you to the audience. Uh, okay, allora, siamo qui con Catherine Fuller. Ci abbiamo fatta, come al solito, avuto dei problemi. Hello, Susan. Okay, qui abbiamo Catherine Fuller direttamente e Susan, che è la persona con cui parlo di solito, se la poverina che sono un po' di cazzo di cazzo di cazzo di cazzo di So we're very thrilled to have you here. Welcome. Uh, the audience is really very happy that to be able to be invited to your speech. That I love totally. Okay, so anytime you want to start telling us about uh, this new release or anything that you want to share with us, we'd be really, really happy to, to, to listen to you. Great. Hi, I can't hear you. we're right excited now. to be here. Oh, no, I we're having a little you. trouble hearing. I can't hear you. You, you can't hear us? I'm not able to can you hear, hear us? you. Do you hear me? We can hear you very lightly. Okay. Oh. Maybe we got some audio problems. I don't know. I'm calling you back. Okay. Hey, it's Susan. I can't hear you. Can you hear me during the live session? We can hear we can hear you uh, very lightly, but you are we can hear you. Uh, okay, okay, just let me grab my phone. We can hear you. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let me see what happens when. Hold on a second. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna get my microphone. I'll okay. get my. I'll get my headset. Okay. I'll just grab my hand as well. Okay. It's probably going to help. Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Somebody's telling me that they can hear you, but cannot hear me. Oh, okay. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Better now? Do you want to turn your volume down and my, ours up? Yes. yes. I'm okay. going to turn my How's that? And then I just added a speaker or a microphone. Okay. Is that, that good. Is that we can hear, oh, you can hear you now. I can hear you now. Oh, great. Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, great. Good, good. Welcome. So, abbiamo risolto. Great. Okay, so anytime you want to uh, tell us something about this new amazing release that we have here, mm -hmm. I still have everything here. I just finished unpacking, and I'm so very happy. <laughs> Good. Great. Yeah, so we're excited to release some new inks because everybody really seems to enjoy our inks. Absolutely. They so well, right? Yeah, you know what? They make us uh, able to stamp without a stamping tool again. <laughs> because they're so rich in color. <laughs> you know, right before we were going to release the inks, uh -huh. uh, of course, we knew and no one else knew that they were coming out. And yeah. we were getting ready to release the background stamp, the peppermint stick. Uh -huh. And when I was creating projects, 
for my audience, I couldn't use my inks because uh, nobody knew about them. There. Of course, and you so, had to keep it secret. Yes. So when I would ink, I would have to use a stamping tool to ink the peppermint stick background, and I would have to ink it four to five times and stamp yeah. it to get a perfect image. But when I use my ink pads, Usually, I could just ink it and stamp once. Yeah, Sometimes once. I have to do it twice because it has it's such a big surface area. Yeah, but that was really hard to not be able to use <laughs> our <laughs> inks during that time. I know. I'll just translate this one so that they know what we're laughing. Um, okay. Ci ha detto che sono molto contente della nuova release degli inchiostri perché funzionano benissimo. Sono tutti molto contenti. Io gli ho detto che i loro inchiostri sono finalmente una cosa che ci permette di timbrare nuovamente senza lo stamping tool, cosa che abbiamo perso la capacità di fare e lei dice che quando hanno fatto uscire gli ink ovviamente loro erano l'unica a sapere che saper sarebbero usciti gli ink e quindi quando hanno presentato i timbri della collezione non potevano usarli hanno dovuto reinchiostrare tipo 45 volte ci diceva per far sì che ci fosse una buona timbrata questi inchiostri sono talmente ricchi di colore che basta un inchiostrato e funzionano ok I got it there. There. Oh, nice. ok now I can see the chat Ok, yeah. <laughs> I'll keep an eye on the questions and the translating requirements that they, that they asked you, so it's going to be ok. <laughs> I was just telling them about your inks and how rich in color they are. <laughs> Great. We're so excited that the May release made it to you. That was really yeah. fast. We've got some new stuff to show your... Yeah, um, I got lots of new customer. stuff to show. Ho un sacco di, di cosine carine da farvi vedere perché ci hanno messo solo tre giorni, loro sono sorpresissime di questa cosa, ma i corrieri fanno miracoli. I was just saying DHL made the miracle. Yes, <laughs> yes. Totally. <laughs> so we got yes. some brand new, um, I got these brand new stamps which are already sold out, right? These two background stamps. Place. The Kaleidoscope, yeah. we sold out last night in our school. Oh, great. We Questi due sono già it. sold out. Mm -hmm. Look at that. In They're our store. So amazing. Out. I believe they are sold out. They're just so versatile. Just can't wait to, to play around with these, you know. <laughs> so um, yeah. we got these three new inks, right? These are the three new ones, mm -hmm. right? Oh, this yellow yeah. is... A great, and it's called Limoncello, we love it. <laughs> Questo è il nuovo ah, giallo. Oh, look at that. Oh, those are the two stamped. Oh, oh that's the background. Oh, mm -hmm. guardate che meraviglia. Quello lì, quella card, è fatta con questo rosa, questo giallo. Questo giallo si chiama Limoncello. Questo si chiama Be Mine, Si Mia. E questo qui, che lei ci sta facendo vedere, è il background stamp, lo stamp per lo, il timbro per lo sfondo. Che meraviglia. That's amazing. And what about a butterfly? Yes. Yes. The butterfly on that card. What's that? The um that's the die. The oh, that's die. Which I didn't get yet, which is not good. Oh. I have to I have to order that. You have to Another order that. Yeah, and I didn't see that stamp. Oh, I think I missed a couple of the new items then because I didn't order that stamp set either. So uh, you will hear from me, Susan, pretty soon. <laughs> you got it, yes. A quanto pare ho dimenticato di ordinare un paio di pezzi, che non va bene. Okay. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. And that, that stamp set is the one you were showing me before? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. cool. Oh, yeah, the one that I forgot to, to, to order. Yeah, that's okay. I will get that right away tonight because, you know, oh, cool. That's really oh. beautiful. Oh, yes, that's the one you told me about. Look at that. Mi hanno mandato questo poster. That's the stamp set, right? That is. The, the, yeah, great. So you got our um, poster. Yep, the poster. poster. This is the first month we're trying that with our stores. So yeah. Which is good. Design team images. Some of the cards Catherine did personally, and um, Elena mm -hmm. did two of the other ones, but uh -huh. they feature all the new colors for May, or the three new colors in mm -hmm. May, and we've also used all that jazz, which, which goes yeah. with that. And the which, new stamps and dies. This is really nice. And this is the stamp set that you were showing us. Questo è il set di timbri che ci stavano facendo vedere, yeah. che ordineremo. Oh, look mm -hmm. at that. So you can um, layer the stamps, right? That's a layering yes. set. 
È un set yeah. che su cui si sovrappongono le timbrate. Guardate che bello il risultato. Oh, this is really beautiful. I will have this hang in my store pretty soon. I just got it today. I didn't have the time yet. But this is going to be All in right. the store. So, <laughs> I have a card that I have not shown on my blog yet. So you oh. guys want to be the first to see. Yes, the this. preview. Yeah, let, let yeah. us see. Ci fa vedere una card che non ha ancora pubblicato sul suo blog. Quindi stiamo, lo stiamo vedendo in anteprima. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. What colors did you use for that? I can spot the, so, uh, the B mine. Be mine. Party dress. Party dress. Uh, party dress and rock and red. Oh, and then cool. melon ice and garden party. Oh, which are two colors that I really love. I saw that you were making like um, color charts on your blog, maybe? Yes. Yes, to yes. show Before how they react. Adesso ci fa vedere, un lei sta facendo dei color charts. Wow, look at that. Uh, guardate, ha praticamente fatto delle prove con la sovrapposizione di timbrate di diversi colori e questi sono i risultati. Um, uh, are we able to see these on your blog or maybe on your Facebook page? Because I, I can't remember where I saw them, but I thought, wow, this is a good idea. Yeah, yeah. this was on oh. Instagram. Instagram, su And... Instagram. Yeah, I will be adding uh, a blog post about this soon. We just haven't okay. gotten there yet. <laughs> Are you going to make those available for a download or for sharing or something? Because I suppose people would really love to have those as a guide. Yeah, so we do have a color combo guide right now for the party oh. collection. And then we're going to be working on one for the spa. And then we'll work on one for the layering. Oh, good. Are they already available on your, on your blog, maybe? Not, no, not, not just yet. yet. Okay. Oh, good. Yeah. I'll just translate this one. Um, mm -hmm. oh, somebody is saying the great idea for the layering test, which is really cool and something we all love to keep and decorate. Ci faranno, renderanno disponibili dal loro, dal loro blog o su Instagram comunque tutte queste charts che stanno facendo per le sovrapposizioni di colori, per le color combination. Oh, look at that. This is a really smart idea. So every time you need to go layering, you know what colors go best with which one. It's really, mm -hmm. it's really smart. That's yeah, great. Yeah, some color combinations are going to, oh. you know, light your fire more than others. Meant so to be in Aquatini. Oh, my. Really? Mm -hmm. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is going to have, I'm going to have time to play tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Aquatini and all that jazz. Guardate, questi sono Aquatini, all that jazz, Fiesta Blue and all that jazz. All that jazz è questo qui. Okay, guardate. My, my pad is filled with uh, glitter because I do, st I do have glitter everywhere in my desk, so. Yes. <laughs> glitter is always nice. Oh, good. Oh, look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> Beautiful. You guys are doing a preview. I have not posted these online yet. I oh, so that's a honor. Siamo i primi a cui li fanno vedere tutti. Oh. <laughs> This is beautiful. Oh, you're violet. <laughs> I know I should be a little bit more into translating, but it's, it just goes into wowing. <laughs> <laughs> Justine Hubby is on here. Hi, Hi Justine. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, look, the Fiesta. Um, uh, no, it's the, it's the Flirty Fuchsia, that one. The I really love that Fuchsia. color. Mm -hmm. I have it somewhere here on my desk, somewhere. Mm -hmm. I love it. You know, I tried blending with your colors, and I had a make and take at the store using your colors, blending, and... Oh. Yeah, and, and having them smooshing as you showed us at the CHI, the Creativation yeah. Show. Oh, Everybody yeah. fell in love. Oh, look. Guardate che meraviglia. Questi sono sfumati. Did you, uh, white, did you hit emboss with the white power, powder, the background stamp? Yes. Oh, questo qui è il timbro. L'hanno embossato con la polverina um, bianca e poi ci hanno sfumato sopra. You see, it's just that stamp that uh, gives you, uh, that yells a card right away. You just, you just have to hit emboss it and just go over with your, your, your inks and, and, and the card is ready. That's beautiful. Yeah. Pretty simple. Total. And then Total. here's the, these are the same colors. Uh-huh. This mm -hmm. just, I spritzed water over it. And okay. let it sit and it, and it kind of lightens up the colors a little bit. Yeah. But it really and looks then, great embossed and you embossed it oh cool mm -hmm. allora la, la seconda card ci ha spruzzato sopra un po' d'acqua l'ha lasciata asciugare chiaramente i colori si sono un pochino um, ammorbiditi everybody is saying that it, these are just beautiful 
I'm reading the comments and trying to, to do a couple of things at the time. So I might miss in something. But everybody looks pretty happy, though. Siete pronti a giocare? Tra un po' giochiamo con queste cosine qua. My customers are pretty used to seeing me play around with the toys, you know, having the store is kind of an excuse to have my own toys. And, <laughs> I, and hands. All day long. I know. <laughs> yeah, that's how I got into this myself. <laughs> really? Uh, I read something about you. Uh, you told me something at the CHA, actually, when we got to, 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 to speak. I still call it CHA. It's not CHA anymore, but... Uh, I know. I, yeah. I, it's kind of hard to dismiss the habit. Um, you got yes. into crafting and then you, you built your own brand, right? Yes. Okay, uh, I'll translate this a little bit. Um, gli ho detto, io, un po', avere il negozio è un po' la mia scusa per avere i miei giocattoli sotto mano. E lei mi dice, è un po' come è successo a me alla fine, perché lei era um, appassionata di, di scrap e poi uh, si è costruita un brand. You started as a stamping up demonstrator, is that right? Yeah. Yeah. I I, I yes, did my homework. A long time ago. <laughs> a long that... time ago. And that, that I did my homework, you know. <laughs> you sure did. <laughs> yeah, and you can still find lots of Stampin' Up videos on my YouTube channel. Really? Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. Back in the day. Back in the day. Well, so really what got you started is that it aligned with the birth of the internet, really, as far as like social media and posting mm -hmm. and you really jumped onto that. Yes. From the get-go. Yes, because I was working really hard to yep. do in-person classes, mm -hmm. which was amazing and wonderful, and I loved that. But when all of my children went to school, I couldn't uh -huh. be gone on nights and weekends anymore, and that's when I pretty much ran my business, of nights course. and weekends. So then I moved it online, and I started the blog, and I started the YouTube uh -huh. channel, and so then I could sell product online. And of then um, I just... As much as I love Stampin' Up, I kind of wanted to spread my wings a little. And, uh -huh. um, and you did it amazingly. <laughs> Thanks. Yes. Yeah, so. Okay. Uh, do you still have time to craft for your, for your own pleasure, you know, or is it just uh, become work? That's a question I really love to ask artists when I have the chance to, because it's a, it's a tricky thing. When, when, you, when you turn this into a job, it kind yes. of becomes a job but still right. a fun one, but still a job, you know? Do you still have the a... pleasure and time to play with it? Right, because I love creating and I uh -huh. love making things and sharing and teaching, mm -hmm. but everything I make is for my blog and YouTube channel. I know, <laughs> yeah, so I know. I'm, that's that's a good way. To create. Okay, but it's a good excuse, you know, to have to create. Somebody still in your craft room would be one of my favorite place after my store. <laughs> Oh, come visit. So nice. Oh, well, don't, don't say that twice. You should see a couple, of, a couple of groups from Italy coming over to you. That would be I'll just, that would well, be I told Susan this morning, my husband and I are going to England tomorrow. And oh, so yeah, I knew about this. Time before I get on a plane. I've never been to Europe before. And so I said to Susan, oh. the next time I go, I should take a side trip to Italy. You definitely should. I would love to have you here. And, you know, we could get you some coffee, some good food, and maybe have some crafting time together. Why not? And yeah, I could bring you more so chocolate, I'll to, you know. I'll have to have um, Susan arm wrestle my husband to see who gets to come see. with me. Right. We'll okay. Out. I'll carry the suitcases or something. I'll, 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 I'll sell them. Oh, so maybe I'll bring both of you. Yeah. That's oh, oh, why not? Yeah. I'll just, Rachel, I'll just translate this a little bit. This is I'll just translate this a little bit so uh, everybody knows what we're talking about. Oh, yeah. Uh, Justine, yes, you need to come over to the store. Absolutely. Let me know if you're coming. Um, allora, ci stava raccontando che lei ha iniziato come mi seduce della Stampin' Up, poi chiaramente ha avuto i bambini, c'era sempre meno tempo e ha cominciato a, um, a voler allargare le ali un pochino di più. Non saprei come tradurlo in italiano di modo che, avesse, che abbia senso, però e così ha costruito il suo brand. Le ho chiesto se uh, ha ancora il tempo di giocare, di creare per sé, ha detto che adesso al momento è un po' tutto diretto sul blog, ma è comunque un modo di giocare con, i propri, con le proprie uh, creazioni. Ha detto che lei domani parte per l'Inghilterra e che la prossima volta che, uh, che viene magari uh, fa un giretto qua in Italia. Uh, everybody still, yeah, do come to Italy, please. It would be amazing to have a class with you or just to have a chance to meet, to meet up and talk, you know? <laughs> Food awesome. is good. Just in case you need a little more convincing, food is really good. <laughs> I've heard. They have good wine, I've heard. And good well, wine, I'm... too. Good chocolate. 
Uh, somebody saying that we have the best weather in the world during summertime, depending where you're going, but still, yes, pretty good. <laughs> where are you exactly living in the States? North, is, are you in North Carolina? We are in North Carolina, so it's on the East Coast. We're about yeah. two hours from the beach, from the oh. ocean, and then okay. two hours from the mountains the other way. Oh, okay, so it's and pretty we're, cool. Halfway in between Atlanta and Washington, D.C. Okay. Well, that's a pretty good place as well. Loro sono in North Carolina, metà tra Atlanta e Washington, D.C. Quindi, <laughs> well, we could switch, you know. You come over to Italy, we go over to your place and travel a little bit around. <laughs> yeah. So, if you want to take a trip to the States, we will take care of you. Oh, great. <laughs> I'm going to definitely see you next year. <laughs> yeah. At the creativation. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Okay, um, so what else? Is there anything you want to know as um, you want us to know about your new release? Um, is there anything that we should be um, aware of? Maybe use something that you created uh, in order to be used for something in particular for, for, for some specific purpose? <clears throat> well, we did the, the no to thanks stamp set. Uh -huh. um, be kind of a all around thanks stamp set because I don't know if, well, I'm sure. A lot of stampers have the same problems. When you have a stamp set, you have one thank you stamp. Yeah. That one stamp may not fit the real yeah. estate that you have for it. Yeah. So you <laughs> might need a bigger one or a smaller one or a little different style. So we just did one thank you set with all different shapes, sizes, styles, and and that's um, great. I also got the Emperor's Art today, the Emperor's Art die, which I forgot to, to bring here, but uh, that's another good good idea to put different sizes and different shapes of the same of the same word of element anyways that you can use and that makes it a lot more versatile I will translate mm -hmm. that um, uh, ci hanno appena detto che hanno fatto il set dove c'è ci sono tutti i thank you ci sono tantissimi thanks thank you in diversi stili e misure oh there it is look at that guardatelo eccolo lì uh, questo arriverà a breve I'm gonna order this pretty soon later I will write you later Susan you got it again <laughs> Ok, um, hanno pensato di fare uno, un, un set solo di uh, sentimenti di ringraziamento e di, e, di, uh, e di grazie, proprio perché a volte facciamo delle card, abbiamo un set con un unico sentiment in un'unica dimensione e stile che magari non sempre si adatta al tipo di card che stiamo facendo e quindi hanno pensato a questa cosa, io dicevo che hanno fatto anche una, una fustella con le commerciali dove ci sono tre diverse, che è una buona idea, ok? Oh, that's Miranda. That's my friend saying hi. She was with me at Creativation. <laughs> okay. Uh, so are we still on time? Maybe you're, you're about to get going, right? You told me you had like 45 minutes. What time is it? What time is it? I couldn't really. I kind of lost track. You want to show some more samples? Sure. I have a few yeah, more Yeah, let's see a few more. Go good. good. With yes. With children for a little while. Okay. okay so this oh, one. Oh, look at that. Ci fa vedere un I po' di esempi. Mm -hmm. I use blackjack. I stamped yeah. it off on scratch paper once to get a lighter gray ink because I just yeah. wanted it to be very light to give yeah. kind of a feel of flowers growing on a lattice. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. That's and really that, beautiful. That thanks. Susan called it a preppy thanks. That's kind of <laughs> monogram style. <laughs> that's really beautiful, though. Oh, I really love that. Last, questo è, un, è stato fatto con questo inchiostro, il blackjack, che è il grigio. L'ha stampato molto, l'ha timbrato molto, molto leggero, di modo che sembrasse che i fiori fossero, stessero crescendo su questa graticola, che è questo, stand, questo timbro qua. Ok? Oh, that's really beautiful. Why didn't I see this butterfly? I don't know. I don't know. That's the problem with me placing the orders late at night when I'm too tired. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> And these are just the four new ink colors, the oh, Be Mind, beautiful. Limoncello, all that jazz and Grape Crush. And when they blend into each other, they make beautiful orange, green, oh, kind of cool. an emerald color. You get all sorts of different looking colors when you blend them together. It's really, really cool. beautiful. I will just translate this. Guardate questi due, um, questi due esempi, sono solo i nuovi inchiostri mescolati insieme, all the jazz, limoncello, e I'll, I'll just get the new ones, this one, and, uh, and the be mine. Mm -hmm. Devono, sono solo questi quattro inchiostri mescolati insieme e danno tutti questi effetti di colore. Oh, cool. You use a, a regular uh, blending tool for this? Mm-hmm. Just the yeah. one by Ranger. 
One by Ranger. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. Where is I've it? seen I've seen artists using even larger dabbers uh, lately, which I'm going to try. But oh, somebody is saying mm-hmm. you're uh, you. Oh, that, there you are. That's the one we're using. Ecco cosa usano? Usano semplicissimo blending tool tondo. Um, somebody was telling about was saying something about your uh, word dies. The awesome. Thank you. The thank you. The thanks die. That was <laughs> like a game changer here. <laughs> Oh, really? I sold a lot of those. Yes, people loved it. You know, I had this. Um, let me see if I can find it. I used it in a make and take at the store, and maybe I can't find it now. But um, they really loved how it turned, and I sold like a lot of those. And people are just—I I got a lot, you know, reserved for when for when it is released again. I can't find okay. the sample, but it's okay. And you have these beautiful words like best, uh, create, awesome, wonderful. I used. Oh, look. I used these two in a in a live video yesterday. Oh, the smile! <laughs> the smile and the wonderful. I they look them. amazing. Beautiful. Ah! Oh. Everybody loves them. Sto dicendo che ci piacciono un sacco le loro parole. Hanno un sacco di fustelle delle parole. Ah, uh, you know, everybody who's into do, making layouts or even simple cards, those words are just awesome. Do more of those. <laughs> okay, that's good feedback. Yeah. Yeah, and, we've had, and we have the thanks is back. So I know you're you. Oh yes, yes. That's out. a. So we'll we'll get that. We'll, they can go out and the order too when you get the the uh, notes. Oh down. great, yeah. great. So I can place the order for the things I forgot to order. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I'll write you later today so we can fix that okay. one. <laughs> Okay. Oh, somebody. Oh, oh, yeah. Favorite. Oh, look at that. These are the new colors also. Also just the new colors. This is flirty fuchsia. Flirty All fuchsia. that jazz. All that jazz. Ready. Oh, lime Ricky. Oh, the lime Ricky. We love that. We yeah. totally love that. Oh, these I are really beautiful. Love. Yes. You know, possibilities are endless when inks blend so well together. And I also tried watercoloring with those. They are great. Totally. So vivid. Yeah. The colors are just so easy to blend and so vivid. Mm-hmm. Okay. Everybody's saying that we need a thank you dye. <laughs> Okay, I got the thankful die, but uh, I will get the thanks the thank die the pretty soon. Die. Yeah. Uh, yeah, definitely tonight. Okay. Oh yeah, some we have thanks. We have and we have thankful. We yeah. Have thank, we have thankful. We have thanks, and we, and we have, have you. you. So a lot you, of our yes. stampers will do. You know, cut out thanks, cut out you, and then clip off the s. Oh. The thanks. Oh, thank that's you. that's true. Uh, ci stanno yeah. dicendo, uh, I'll translate this, mm-hmm. ci stanno dicendo che hanno la fustella thanks, e la fustella thankful, e la, fu- la fustella you. Quindi molti tagliano il thanks e il you e tolgono la S dal thanks, così diventa thank you. See, somebody's telling me the Kaleidos cup is beautiful. Look at that. Stupendo. Oh, thank you. Stupendo, oh. yes. Uh, absolutely. So yeah. Everybody wants it. Okay, I'll, I'll just publish Run. all these on the store to later tonight, because, you know, uh, I got this right before lunch, so it was a really tough lunch break, but really <laughs> happy to have my new toys here, you know? <laughs> okay, oh, let me see if, the, if, if anybody has questions just before you go. Um, avete delle domande? C'è qualcosa che volete chiedere? Così ne approfittiamo, dato che le abbiamo qui. Insomma, non, non ci capita spessissimo, quindi ne approfittiamo. And I got a few of your dyes here that I wanted to, that I had here to show the awesome dye. This is the awesome die, and I had the thankful die somewhere. There it is. Mm-hmm. Excellent. Yeah, these are beautiful, and the best too. I really love those. Mm-hmm. Okay, let me see if, if anybody has questions. Yeah. Uh, okay, abbiamo delle domande. Volete che chiediamo qualcosa? Sono state carinissime, però tra poco devono andare perché hanno degli impegni, chiaramente. Somebody is asking about the refillers for the uh, for the inks. Mm-hmm. You got the ink, the rinkers, mm-hmm. the bottles, the simple bottles. Oh, yeah. Yes, you told me. I, I was uh, 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 there. You are. Guardate, le quelli sono i rinker. When the pad is gone, you can just re-ink it with that one. Yep. Okay. Would you recommend when you when uh, when your colors are used to uh, create splashes and 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 maybe just um, watercolor? Do you recommend to use the inkers or uh, to to take the ink from the pad? That is a great question. <laughs> if you take, if you use the reinker, you're going to uh-huh. get a stronger, darker, yeah, uh, concentration. Yes, concentration. Yeah. <laughs> so if you want a little bit lighter, 
you can go with the pad. With the pad. Okay, uh, I'll translate this. Um, le ho chiesto um, se consigliano quando dobbiamo spatasciare fondamentalmente ma non potevo tradurre spatasciare uh, se consigliano di prendere i reinker o di prendere l'inchiostro dai pad loro dicono se li prendete dal, dal reinker è semplicemente più intenso se lo volete un po' più chiaro dal, dal cuscinetto somebody is asking um, um, how do you get inspired to create a new palette of colors and uh, where do the names come from because they're really cool names <laughs> I love the peppermint scrub is one of my favorite, both for the names and for the color. <laughs> Thank you. So uh, when we put a collection together, we like to do eight. So uh -huh. we have the party and the spa. So those are the main two lines. Yeah. And then in, under those are collections. So we like yeah. to do eight. And it has to be a rainbow. So it has to be oh. pink, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. Uh -huh. so we, need make, we need to make sure we hit every color Shade. under the rainbow. Which okay. is like six, so then we have yeah. two more to play with. Uh -huh. And then we just kind of fill in. But we, with each collection, we like to do, you know, the party is the vibrant colors. Uh -huh. Spot is muted. So uh -huh. we have to pick, pick the colors based on that. And then, like, if you look at Spring Fling, they're all lighter shades. Yes. And the like... life of the party is darker shades. Uh -huh. So that, it's very... We have a lot of parameters around how we pick colors. And how long does it take you to, to pick the colors? That's a lot. It takes a while. Uh -huh. uh, it takes a team mm. of, pe of people, uh, a lot of input from a lot of different, you know, people around the office. We work as a team to do that. Uh -huh. uh, and even sometimes when we pick a color, because they're all custom colors to us, you know, uh -huh. we... And then sometimes the manufacturer will make the color that we want and we get it and it, it's not quite right. So sometimes okay. we go back and forth <laughs> a good number of times before we get it right. <laughs> I, I, I can imagine it takes quite a while, but you know, it shows that there is a lot of work behind this because yeah. these colors are really great and, and, and you can see the study behind it. So uh, it's really something people do appreciate. So good. Just to give you a feedback of what I get told by customers, uh, they can tell there's a lot of work behind this. Thank because you. Because it's not just picking colors from the rainbow. These are really uh, peculiar shades, you know, and it shows. Yeah. So the hard work is, is showing. It's very calculated. How we I know. It's not okay. Just, yeah. okay, I'll so just translate. You. Well, welcome. I'll just translate this. Um, le, um, abbiamo chiesto come scelgono i colori, loro dicono che lavorano sull'arcobaleno, quindi cioè, loro li, li fanno uscire di 8 in 8 e ogni release deve avere tutte, eh, tutte le sfumature dell'arcobaleno più due colori con cui giocare, ci hanno detto. Uh, C'è un sacco di studio dietro, tante volte devono fare tantissime prove, un team intero che, che ci lavora e io le ho, detto, ho detto loro che il, il lavoro si vede. Uh, how do you pick the names? The names are awesome. You know, uh, it's great. Just um, not all colors have really funny names, and these are really nice. Pixie dust, come on, pixie dust. <laughs> so this also takes a team. Some have been uh -huh. named by my children. Some have been oh. named by my friends. Um, <clears throat> so we, with the party, with the party collection, uh -huh. all the names have to have something to do with a party or yeah. celebration or something exciting and fun, and then. Mm -hmm. uh, the spa, something soothing, something spa uh -huh. related, something relaxing, like daydream. Yeah, so, daydream. And then we just kind of sit down and brainstorm and throw things around. Uh -huh. Sometimes they come quickly and sometimes it takes a long time to, we're like, oh, this color, what are we going to name it? <laughs> I get it, but all names are really nice and very, um, you know, easy to uh, come at mind. Once you see the color, you, you know, this is the skylight and you're not going to forget it. So, because it kind of stays in your mind. So <laughs> is there a name that you have uh, a particular, uh, that, you, that you are particularly fond of? A favorite name? Right now it's probably Brave Crush because uh -huh. what, when we released or announced it, my brother came to the office and he is a bartender at uh, his side oh. gig. Is, he's a bartender. So he, at home, like when we have parties and stuff, or family gatherings, he makes me a great crush. Oh, so I always told him that I was going to name an ink that. And this is a beautiful color. Thanks. 
No, ok, I'll just translate this a little bit. Um, dice che ogni volta che devono uh, scegliere un colore è un lavoro di squadra, si siedono lì, fanno un po' di brainstorming, alcuni sono nomi che arrivano magari dai bambini, altri arrivano dagli amici, a volte un nome arriva velocemente, altre volte ci vanno giorni e giorni di lavoro. Forse il suo preferito in questo momento è il Grape Crush, perché suo marito fa il barista e ogni volta che fanno delle riunioni in famiglia, delle feste tra amici, lui le fa un drink che si chiama Grape Crush e lei ha sempre detto che avrebbe fatto prima o poi un, un colore, ed eccolo qua. So we're all ready to play with your grape crush. So we all know, we, we know what's behind it. <laughs> lime yeah. ricky is the same. My kids like me to make raspberry lime rickies for them. Uh-huh. Oh. Non-alcoholic, of course. Non-alcoholic, of course. I've been making those for my kids for years. <laughs> That's cool. So this is really cool. I always tell my customers um, uh, when I talk about your inks that I, I didn't know you before Creativation this year. Yeah. And when I uh, stepped uh, behind your, um, beside your store, I saw this wall fill, filled with your ink pads. And I fell in love with it. And I couldn't stop by the first day I saw you. And I said, okay, I have to know. Then I have to go back. And I have a terrible sense of orientation. It took me like the whole second day to come back to you. <laughs> Oh, I tend to get I'm lost pretty easily. <laughs> yes, I found you. <laughs> and I, I always say that I was enchanted behind, uh, b before all of these inks, uh, the shape, the colors, uh, you know, the booth was really, really, really lovely. And um, I knew I, I just had to try and, and play with your inks and my customers are just loving them. Everybody who gets to try these just falls in love with them. <clears throat> just so you know. I'm so happy. Oh, uh, somebody is asking if you uh, actually expected such a um, such an amazing success after the creativation, uh, because you really you were in the spotlight, right? And there are many actually there are many watercolorable inks on the market, but yours seem to have like you know um, a sort of a nudge. I don't know. They're they're, they're good, so people pr are probably able to tell this, and that's why they're good. But did you expect this? Did um, you expect them to be this successful? No. It And when bringing ink to the market was not easy, uh, uh -huh. it took about a year to, from start to releasing the first set. And uh, there were a lot of decisions to be made along the way. There was a lot of work on formulation because I knew I, if I was going to bring out ink, I wanted it to be different than everyone else's ink. Um, and, okay. And we achieved that by the color, the color, the way we put the colors together and uh -huh by the no splotchy images. So working with the, you know, manufacturer to get the ink to not be splotchy was not mm -hmm. easy. I can time. imagine. And I cried a lot and I almost <laughs> gave up a couple of times. So, no, 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 it's then, good that you didn't give up. We need more you. of this. <laughs> and then because it's on a foam pad, people are used to a foam pad and yep. you have to use them a little differently. And I was mm -hmm. very, very scared that people, because people don't like change. I so know, I was but very frightened that people were not going to be able to change. So, but you know, so we have you, been so delighted. Yeah, but the difference is that the once they get to see how this works, you know, they're going to get their hands stained once, and then they're going to love the fact of this. And then getting our hands stained is just part of the fun, you know. Yes, or so, then you get this. <laughs> or you get what's that? Ink, ink this was a creativation. Oh yeah, for the for the stays. Yeah. Oh, I missed it. Some I probably didn't get to the booth because it got lost. Probably. But <laughs> I'm gonna catch on that. I'm gonna catch on yeah. that like next year. So does it work? <laughs> it does. It takes Sharpie out of your shirt too. Really? Oh, cool. Because I'm using another product here in Italy, another detergent to to get my hands clean. But my 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 skin is sort of falling off. So. Oh. But you're, <laughs> You know, I, I did this live yesterday for the one that I, uh, that I showed you before with the, with the two um, uh, die cut words. And I used the juniper mist to, um, to stamp all of these flowers. These are stamped with your ink. Oh, wow. those are beautiful. And my hands are totally blue. We're totally blue. Like the whole night. <laughs> that looks Amazing. Your inks are amazing. So every Thank everything you. you stamp with those turned out really beautiful. I'll, I'll just translate this a little bit again. Um, okay. Mi dicevano che erano un po' impaurite quando hanno messo sul mercato questi inchiostri perché il mettere sul mercato un inchiostro è sempre complicato perché ce ne sono tanti, perché bisogna trovare <coughs> la formula giusta, perché bisogna far sì che la gente non si spaventi perché questi hanno i cuscinetti di, um, uh, di spugna e quindi sono un pochino, sono diversi da usare, non è che siano più complicati, sono solo diversi e gli ho detto che sono fantastici però mi sono 
sono rimaste le mani blu dopo il, il lo di ieri mi ha fatto vedere questo, questo pulitore che mi ha detto che era il creativation io non l'ho visto probabilmente perché non sono arrivata a quel boot mi sarò persa ok so uh, I don't know how to thank you for uh, taking time and be with us today It was such a yeah. honor to have you here, and I'm really hoping that we can uh, maybe do this again for another release or anytime you want, you have some time for a chat or, or a live class, I don't know. Um, whatever yeah. you, you, you'd like to share with us will be really um, appreciated. My customers are all uh, thanking you for being here, and no they, are, uh, they just told me that I need to publish the pictures of, your new, of the new arrivals very soon because they want to order them, so it's okay. <laughs> I'll do that later, I, prom I promise. Um, Thank you so much again to the both of you, Catherine and Susan. Uh, it was really lovely to have you here and to be able to talk and see you again. Um, I will you. write Thank you. Thank you for having us. Oh, thank you. It was my honor, really. My pleasure. Absolutely. Okay. Um, everybody's saying thanks. I'm seeing the comments and the hearts. Thank you. <laughs> thanks for having us. Uh, somebody is saying something really nice. Uh, they're saying thank you for the enthusiasm that you're sharing with us because it's not really something yeah. that you should take for granted. It's not like everybody. So thank you for the passion that you're sharing with us, for the creativity, for not giving up when you felt like you had to give up. So <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you okay. for lifting me up today. I oh, thank it. you. <laughs> ok, ragazzi, yeah. le salutiamo, diciamo ciao, ci risentiamo spero presto con loro. Thank you so much. I'll just end this up by um, finishing okay. the live and I'll write you later. Thank you so much again. Okay. Uh, I left a piece of my heart at your booth at Creativation, so thank you for bringing it back today. Thank oh, you. you. Bye. Thank you so yes. much. It was wonderful. Bye. I can't wait to see you again. Okay. Okay, Bye. it's coming soon. Bye.